Hello, I'm Anthony Hughes. Here at Steinberg, we're incredibly proud of the features we've built into Dorico to make inputting music as quick and fun as possible. With Dorico 5, we've pushed things along even further by making it easier to create multiple instances of a notation item all at once. Previously, other than a couple of exceptions with things like slurs and dynamics, if you made a multiple selection, either at different points on the same staff or across multiple staves, Dorico would create just one item at the start and top of that selection. In Dorico 5, this behavior has been overhauled, making it easy to create multiple items at the same time, across different instruments and at different positions. Simply make a selection for each staff and rhythmic position that you want the notation, and then create the item as normal, using either the relevant notation panel or popover. What's great is that the selections on different staves don't all need to start at the same position. For example, this passage where these parts have staggered entrances but all need the same dynamics applied. Dorico can even work out how to handle notes of different lengths. If you would rather all items were always created at the same rhythmic position, you can uncheck this option in the editing section of preferences and Dorico will use the earliest position selected as the insertion point for all items. The new behavior makes creating a passage of glissando lines super simple. Even glissandos between chords, and even chords with different numbers of notes. And look how easy it is to add arpeggio lines to all of these chords in just one click. When creating playing techniques, Dorico knows whether to input multiple items of the same type on each selected note head, or to create a single item with a duration that matches your selection. By default, creating trills will input one single trill that lasts the length of the current selection. If you prefer, you can set this preference that will then tell Dorico to create separate trills on each individual note. And that's multiple item creation in Dorico 5. I'm Anthony Hughes. Thanks for watching.